Well, as ever, it's the Conservative Party, of course, dominating the news. Rishi Sunak's deal with the European Commission on the Northern Ireland Protocol, and he went to Belfast on Friday. The DUP don't seem to like it. Well, if it's got anything to do with the European Court of Justice, there'll be a huge backbench rebellion within his own party. I have to say on trade, if the green lane for goods between the mainland and Northern Ireland genuinely was a green lane, maybe there, there is some room for compromise. But we'll see how it all works out. Big irony, I thought. Boris Johnson, the man who openly lied to the people of Northern Ireland, who cast Northern Ireland out into a different arrangement. Now, he did it. He did it, arguably, to save the rest of the UK from being forced into the customs union and the single market. But for Boris, the man who did that now, to come back and be the saviour of Northern Ireland was an irony I found quite tough to take over the weekend. And it's pretty clear that there were some games going on within the Conservative Party. Damien Green, a former Deputy Prime Minister up until 2017, Damien Green has effectively been deselected for the new seat of Weald of Kent. Why? Well, I think he was seen to be one of the most prominent pro common marketeers and an anti-Borisite. So I wonder, are the Conservative Party about to plunge themselves back into an internal civil war? Let me know what you think. Farage at GBNews.uk.